Hello everyone, welcome to Harshi E class. I am Rani. Today, I will solve class 6 mathematics chapter 3, playing with numbers. In that exercise 3.7, question number 1 to 6. Exercise 3.7, first sum. Renu purchases two bags of fertilizers of weights 75 kg and 69 kg. Find the maximum value of weight which can measure the weight of the fertilizer exact number of times. So the maximum value means here we need to find the HCF of given weights. Statements. Weight of the first bag 75 kg. Weight of the second bag 69 kg. So the maximum value of weight for finding that we need to find the HCF of 75 and 69 by using prime factorization method. 75. 75 is an odd number. It is divisible by 3. 3 twos are 6. 3 fives are 15. 25 is also an odd number. It is divisible by 5. Next prime number is 5. 5 fives are 25. Again, 5 ones are 5. So the prime factorization of 75 is 3 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 5. 3 fives are 15. 15 fives are 75. Next 69. 69 is also an odd number. It is divisible by 3. 3 twos are 6 and 3 threes are 9. 23. 23 is a prime number. Prime number is a number which is divisible by 1 and the number itself. So the prime factors of 69 is 3 multiplied by 23. 323 are 69. Find the common factors. Here there is only one common factor that is 3. So the HCF of 75 and 69 is 3. Final statement. Therefore, the required maximum value of weight is 3 kg. Second sum, three boys step off together from the same spot. Number of boys are three. They started walking together from the same spot. Their steps measure 63 centimeter, 70 centimeter and 77 centimeter respectively. What is the minimum distance each should cover so that all can cover the distance in complete steps? The minimum distance here is the LCM of the given numbers. LCM of 63, 70 and 77. So find the LCM by using short division method. Short division method means here we are going to divide all the given three numbers at a time. 63, 70, 77. The first prime number is 2. First prime number 2. 63 is an odd number. It is not going to be completely divisible by 2. Write it down as it is. 63 will come down as it is. 70 is an even number. 2, 35 are 70. 77 is also an odd number. Write 77 down as it is. Now all are odd numbers. Let's check with 3. Next prime number 3. 3, 21 are 63. 35 is not going to be completely divisible by 3. So, write it down. Next, 77 is also not going to be completely divisible by 3. 77 will come down as it is. Again, 21 is divisible by 3. 3, 7 are 21. 35 will come down as it is. 77 also will come down as it is. 5. 5 can divide 35. Next prime number is 5. So 7 comes down as it is 5. 7s are 35. And 77 also comes down as it is. After that next prime number is 7. Next prime number 7. 7 1s are 7. Again 7 1s are 7. 7 11s are 77. Here 11 is also a prime number which is divisible by 1 and number itself. So, 11 ones are 11. 
एलसीएम ऑफ 63 70 एंड 77 इज द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दीस प्राइम नंबर्स दैट इज 6930 सेंटीमीटर 6930 सेंटीमीटर therefore the minimum distance that each should cover is 6930 cm third sum the length breadth and height of your room are 825 cm 675 cm and 450 cm respectively find the longest tape which can measure the three dimensions of the room exactly first write the statements and here in the question the longest tape that means we need to find the hcf of the given numbers the length of your room 825 cm breadth of your room 675 cm and height 450 cm the longest tape which can measure the three dimensions of the room is the hcf of 825 675 and 450 let's find the hcf of these three numbers 825 it is an odd number so it is not going to be divisible by 2 let's check with 3 3 2s are 6 three 7s are 21 3 5s are 50 now 2 7 5 275 sum of these digits is 14 that means it is not going to be completely divisible by 3 it is divisible by 5 so 5 5 are 25 again 5 5 are 25 55 which is a multiple of 5 5 11 are 55 11 is a prime number 11 ones are 11 the prime factorization of 825 is 3 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 5 by 11 next prime factorization of 675 675 it is divisible by 3 3 2s are 6 again 3 2s are 6 and 3 5s are 15 225 is also divisible by 3 Three sevens are twenty-one. Three fives are fifteen. Seventy-five. Three twenty-fives are seventy-five. Five fives are twenty-five. Five ones are five. Write the prime factorization of six hundred seventy-five. Next four hundred fifty. Four hundred fifty is an even number. It is divisible by two. Two twos are four. Again, two twos are four. Two fives are ten. Two hundred twenty-five. Two hundred twenty-five is divisible by three. Three seventy-five are two hundred twenty-five. Three twenty-five are seventy-five. Five fives are twenty-five. Five ones are five. Prime factorization of four hundred fifty. Let's find the common factors. Find the common factors. Three, three is a common factor. After that, five, five is also the common factor. Two fives are there. One and another. One, two. So three, five, five. Common factors of these three numbers are three, five, five. Three fives are fifteen. Fifteen fives are seventy-five. HCF is nothing but the product of common factors. So three fives are fifteen. Fifteen fives are seventy-five. The HCF of given numbers is seventy-five. Therefore, the required longest tape is seventy-five centimeter. Fourth sum. Determine the smallest three-digit number which is exactly divisible by six, eight, and twelve. Here we need to find the smallest three-digit number, which is exactly divisible by six, eight, and twelve. All these three numbers. So find the LCM of six, eight, and twelve. Find the LCM of six, eight, and twelve. 
by using short division method divide all the three numbers at a time 6 8 and follow all of even numbers those are divisible by 2 2 3s are 6 2 4s are 8 2 6 are 12 next 2 3 is not going to be divisible by 2 so write it down as it is 2 2s are 4 2 3s are 6 again here one even number is there so again we will divide with 2 only 3 comes down as it is 2 1s are 2 and 3 comes down as it is now all our odd numbers let's check with 3 3 1s are 3 Again, 3, 1s are 3. So, the LCM of 6, 8 and 12 is 2, 2s are 4. 4, 2s are 8. 8, 3s are 24. LCM of the given 3 numbers is 24. Let's find the multiples of 24. 24 is the lowest common multiple of 6, 8 and 12. 24 is the lowest common multiple of 6, 8 and 12. Let's find the other multiples of 24. 24, 1s are 24, 24, 2s are 48, 24, 3s are 72, 24, 4s are 96, 24, 5s are 120. In the multiples of 24, the smallest three digit number is 120. So, the smallest three digit number which is ex exactly divisible by 6, 8 and 12 is 120. That is 120. You can check by dividing 120 with 6, 8 and 12 also. 120 divided by 6 20 120 divided by 6 divided by 8 next number 8 so divide by 8 is 15 120 divided by 12 is equals to 10 so the num the three digit the smallest three digit number which is exactly divisible by 6 8 and 12 is 120 Fifth sum, determine the greatest three digit number exactly divisible by 8, 10 and 12. This is also same like the fourth sum. In the same way we will solve finding the LCM of 8, 10 and 12. So the LCM of 8, 10 and 12. 8, 10 and 12. 8, 10, 12, all these are even numbers divisible by 2. 2, 4s are 8. 2, 5s are 10. 2, 6 are 12. 4 and 6 are even numbers. They are divisible by 2. So, 2, 2s are 4. 5 is not going to be completely divisible by 2. Write it down as it is. 2, 3s are 6. Again, 2 is an even number. 2, 1s are 2. 5 comes down as it is. 3 also. Next prime number 3, 3 1s are 3, <coughs> 5, 5 1s are. So the LCM of 8, 10 and 12, 2 2s are 4, 4 2s are 8, 8 3s are 24, 24 5s are 120. Here 120 is the lowest common multiple of 8, 10 and 20. Let's find the other multiples of 120. 120, 1s are 120. 120, 2s are 240. 123, sir, 360. 124, sir, 480. 5s. 600, 126, uh, 720, 
सेवेंस आर एट हंड्रेड फोर्टी वन हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी एट सर नाइन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी एंड नाइन सर वन थाउजेंड एटी सो द ग्रेटेस्ट थ्री डिजिट नंबर हियर इन दिस मल्टीपल्स द ग्रेटेस्ट थ्री डिजिट नंबर इज नाइन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी आफ्टर दैट फोर डिजिट नंबर्स आर गोइंग टू बी स्टार्ट सो नाइन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी इज द ग्रेटेस्ट थ्री डिजिट नंबर एक्जैक्टली डिविजिबल बाई एट टेन एंड ट्वेल्व एट टेन एंड ट्वेल्व सिक्स सम द ट्रॉफिक लाइट्स एट थ्री डिफरेंट रोड क्रॉसिंग चेंज आफ्टर एवरी फोर्टी एट सेकेंड्स सेवेंटी टू सेकेंड्स एंड वन हंड्रेड एट सेकेंड्स रेस्पेक्टिवली इफ दे चेंज सिमियल्टेनियसली एट सेवन ए एम सेवन ए एम सेवन ए एम मीन्स इन द मॉर्निंग एट वॉट टाइम विल दे चेंज सिमियल्टेनियसली अगेन वेर एवर देर आर टाइम इंटरवेल Sums comes. That means we need to find the LCM of the given numbers. So, LCM of forty-eight, seventy-two, and one hundred eight. Forty-eight, seventy-two, and one hundred eight. All are even numbers divisible by two. Two. Twenty-four sa forty-eight, two thirty-six sa seventy-two, two fifty-four sa one hundred eight. Again, all are even numbers. Two twelve sa, two eighteen sa, and two twenty-seven sa. Twelve and eighteen both are even numbers divisible by two. Two six sa. 29 sir and 27 is not going to be completely divisible by 2 so write it down as it is 6 is an even number which is divisible by 2 2 3 are 6 9 comes down as it is 27 next all are odd numbers let's check with the next prime number 3 3 1 are 3 3 3 are 9 3 9 are 27 3 and 9 are again divisible by 3 3 1 are 3 3 3 are 9 Three, one sir. So the LCM of forty-eight, seventy-two, and one hundred eight is four times two and three times three. Product of four times two and three times three is four hundred thirty-two seconds. Four hundred thirty-two seconds. Convert these seconds into minutes. Four hundred thirty-two seconds. Convert these seconds into minutes. Divided by sixty, that is seven minutes twelve seconds. Already at seven a.m., the time change. Then again, seven a.m. plus seven minutes twelve seconds. That is seven minutes twelve seconds past seven a.m. Again, they will change simultaneously. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe to my channel.